Researchers have announced the creation of a synthetic bacterium with an incredible 101,000 changes to its genome. The entire genome has been recoded to free up seven of the 64 codons in the genetic code. Michael, can you tell us why this is such an incredible achievement? I think it's probably fair to say this is the furthest we've ever gone in terms of creating life that is different to anything that's evolved naturally. Now, as things stand, this bacterium simply has seven codons that it isn't using, but in future, the team can assign these codons to amino acids that don't occur naturally. Okay, can you take us through again why we want to free up the codons? One of them is that by making further tweaks to this bacterium, they can make it completely resistant to viruses. Now, that's because viruses rely on their hosts to make viral proteins. So if you change the genetic code in a cell, then when a virus infects that cell, its viral proteins are going to come out all wrong and it's not going to be able to replicate. The other reason for freeing up these codons is so these bacteria can make new kinds of proteins unlike anything that exists naturally. Remember I said there were 20 natural amino acids. So once you've freed up codons, you can then reassign those to different amino acids that aren't part of those 20 natural ones. So in theory, SYN57 could produce proteins that contain 27 different kinds of amino acids, which opens up all kinds of possibilities. 